Hey you guys, Chelsea Shaw here. I am so excited to talk to you tonight about some revelations that God's been giving me, some prophetic art that I've been doing. Um, yeah, and I just want to get to know you guys better. I feel like I'm always on random videos with my husband, but God's been burning on my heart to make some videos and to really step out there, step forward. And I'm going to tell you guys, this has been a battle for me. This has been like, you know, God's like <laughs> telling me to do this and I'm like, not that God, you know, it's like, this has been a battle. So I'm glad to be here tonight. And I want to start by sharing with you guys the first prophetic painting that I ever did. This is called the Prince of Peace. I was doing this during worship one night. I was just worshiping God and he put it on my heart to start painting. As I was painting, I saw all these flames and this was a time in our life when we were going through a lot of battles. We were going through so many things and it honestly, this was a time in my life where I would wake up in the morning and I would feel so bombarded and attacked by the enemy that I would have to press through sometimes for a couple hours in worship and prayer and really fight for peace. And it became a habit every single morning. I would wake up, I would feel all this pressure all over my body and I would have to fight through it into victory. I would have to fight through it into his peace. And from that really came this painting where during this time in my life, we were worshiping. I started painting. I started seeing all these flames coming out of this painting. And in the flames came out of came this face of a lion. And when I started painting in the eyes, I felt so drunk in the spirit. I felt the peace of God fall on me. And what really struck me about his eyes is that he was not looking at the enemy. He wasn't roaring. He wasn't in a battle. He was full of peace and his gaze was fixed on me. He was 100% attentive to me. And when I look into his eyes, I felt that peace. And this is really like one of my life revelations is that no matter what you're going through, no matter what giants you're facing, no matter what you're battling, God is our Prince of Peace. He is all powerful. He's an all consuming fire and his love, his attention, his gaze is fixed on you. And when you fix your eyes on Jesus, you get complete peace. You get perfect peace. It says there is no fear in love, but perfect love casts out all fear. And I just hope this encourages you tonight that no matter what you're going through, no matter what you're battling, he is the Prince of Peace. He's with you. He's bigger than any enemy that you're facing and he's for you. He loves you. So let's pray. God, I just thank you for every person watching this right now. I pray that you would fill them with your peace, God. I pray for a deeper revelation of your peace, Father, for a deeper revelation of your love, God. I pray, God, that you would fill every heart and every mind, that you would calm every heart and every mind, God. That you would restore confidence in you, Father. I just ask, God, that every battle, every giant that has exalted itself in our minds above you or bigger than you, God, would be diminished back down, God, and that we would see those giants as little ants, God, compared to you. I pray, God, that you would overwhelm us with your love, overwhelm us with your victory, God, that the victory has already been paid for on the cross and we get to step into that victory that you already won. So Father, I ask that your presence would fill every heart and every home watching this tonight. In Jesus' name, amen. Hey, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if this video inspired you, um, make sure you subscribe. Check out our website, www.walkafterchrist.com. For the first time ever, I have my prints of, of the lion available on there. And if this inspired you, if this impacted you tonight, please leave me a comment. I would love to hear about it. If God's been giving you similar revelation right now, I would love to hear about that too. God bless you guys, and I look forward to posting more videos about revelation and prophetic art.